how to upload folders on github good day folks welcome to the channel if you've got large folders you need to upload to github this is the guide that you need so let's jump straight in on the left hand side on your home page you'll find all your repositories and um, if you haven't yet signed in you can do so from this page github.com and we can either go into one of our existing repositories or we can go ahead and we can tap on new either one will be exactly the same now once you get to the point where you have your repository you're going to go ahead under the quick setup guide there is the upload an existing file now once you go in there you'll notice that you can choose files over here and you cannot actually choose a folder directly from here so if i'm tapping on this folder and tapping open in actual fact it'll open the folder and not actually upload it so how do we go about this so the first thing you want to do in this process is download git and git dot scm.com i will leave a link in the description below you want to download this for your system so we're going to just go ahead and close this window for now and right here on our desktop you can see that we have some folders and i'm going to select the folder that we would like to upload so this one over here says maternity i'm going to hit that one over there i'm going to open it up now in this blank space over here you can right click and you will on Windows 11 tap on show more options but if you're on Windows 10 you won't have to tap on show more options these options will already be available on this window the thing that you're looking for here is open git bash here and we're going to tap on that now it has opened this master folder in git the next thing you want to do is make sure that you've got this um, git bash open on one side of your screen and you've got your github open on the right hand side now what you're going to do to initiate the folder being um, uploaded into github is in the instructions over here as they give you just underneath the quick setup there is a few commands now the first command you want to use here is the git init so what we're going to do is we're going to highlight that and we are going to copy that and we are then going to paste it right in over here so we're going to right click and we're going to paste and we're going to hit enter so what it says here is it's reinitialized existing git repository in and then it gives you of course the path so the next thing we want to do here is instead of adding git add readme what we're going to do is we are going to add the git add right we're going to copy that and we're going to come over here and we're going to run it as a command we're going to right click and say paste so what we're going to do then is say space and a full stop now basically what this does is it allows um git to want to upload the entire folder that we are wanting to upload into github so there we go we're going to hit enter and you can see over here it is now starting to upload the folder now just to make a, another check that our files are actually being seen over here we're going to go ahead and we are going to tap on the command line again and we are going to tap in git space status and we're going to hit enter on that one now you can see it says no commits yet that's fine and changes to be committed we can see here all of the files that are actually in that folder the next command you want to use here is the one just underneath that git add and that is git commit dash m and there's a first commit now you want to make sure that you are copying that entire command and again we're going to go ahead and paste it over here in the git bash on the left hand side we're going to hit enter on this one and you can see over here now that it says create mode and it's now given me all my file names the next code we're going to use is the git branch right over here on the right hand side and we are going to again copy this and we're going to paste it in over here on the left hand side now basically what this is creating is a branch and by default it has named that branch main um, you can also replace it with branch with path so basically this is how you will find um, where your folders are we're going to hit enter and that is now in the main the next thing you want to do is go ahead 
and use the next command which is git remote add origin and you will see that this is actually your url forward slash your repository name and then you're going to copy this again we're going to right click copy and we are going to paste this here now basically what is going to happen now is this command is going to allow github to be able to see the file on your desktop or on your laptop or whatever device you're using so we're going to go ahead and tap enter and that command now is submitted the last thing you want to do here is copy the git push origin main and this will basically solidify the connection as you see over here i have already hit it in there and you will then get a window that will ask you to sign in and you will now get to this page right over here you're going to now tap on the authorize git ecosystem and you're just going to give it a few seconds we are now going to just open up this page fully and what will happen now within the next few minutes is that this will start uploading as you can see over here um, it has started uploading and if it doesn't immediately show on your page what you'll have to do is just uh, refresh this page once this command has been run completely uh, right now you can see that it's on 8 of 14 it's on 57 percent there we go you can see now that these um, files have been uploaded um, some of the files within the folder are a little bit larger than um, what I'm allowed to actually move over but if you go ahead and you refresh your github page you will now see that these files within that folder have been uploaded there we go I hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions please leave it in the comment section below we'd love to hear from you we'll see you in another great video cheerio